capacity of the baby. Yeah. Uh, it's practically unheard about, even the high ranking uh, officers never heard of it. We were uh, you know, gun crews on nursing ships. Uh, gun crews consisting of uh, approximately 21 to 31 uh, gunners and one officer. Yeah. Uh, no, no medics, no radar. No, no support except those, those guns we had. Not the convoy duty at the North Atlantic, uh, the South Atlantic, Africa, uh, Australia, and the Philippines, and Borneo. Uh, our ship was uh, in Sydney, Australia. We took on 600, about 600 of those Australian troops. Of course, we didn't know where we were heading, but we ended up in Borneo. Uh, Brunei Bay, Borneo. And during this trip, which took approximately seven or eight days, I got friendly with this one soldier. And uh, when we anchored in Borneo, we disembarked these soldiers down the nets into the landing craft. This one soldier, I'll never forget it, he was looking at me and I was looking at him right in the eyes, and he dropped his rifle into the ocean. I know for one to one half to that kid. About the same age as I was. Yeah. You drop the rifle into the ocean, what happens? It just. It you're, just no it just, one. His face just went blank. Yeah. So I hate to see what happened to him when he went ashore. Yeah, because he's got no weapon. Well, you could hear gunfire coming from the shore. I know he had to go face something.